always tracking, always alerting. Storm Team 8. Nice day today. Nice way to kick off the month of December. Saw plenty of sunshine, but that's going to start to fade tomorrow as our next system moves in. In fact, if we look at StormTrack Live, we take the view wide, you can start to see the leading edge of our next system spilling in as clouds. We also have an area of high pressure that's streaming off to the south. And if we look at your future cast forward, you can see that this system is a fast mover kicking out the area of high pressure and bringing in this next wave of wind and next wave of cold. Friday, 10 o'clock, still very mild outside, but once we see the cold front move through overnight Friday into Saturday, it opens the doors for cold air to rush in. And by the time we get to 7 a.m. on Saturday, it's cloudy, but much colder than Friday. And we could once again see wind chills in the 20 degree range. So enjoy the quiet conditions tonight. We have just a few clouds out there. Wind is out of the south. Temperatures are in the 30s. We're going to climb pretty quickly tomorrow as warm air slides in from the southwest. This helps to bump our temperatures to the mid to upper 40s on Friday. But just as soon as it arrives, the cold air gets fed in for Saturday. And that's going to be pulling from chilly air that's right out of the heart of uh, the Arctic. So it is going to be another swift drop, just like we experienced Tuesday into Wednesday. I want to show you the next 24 hours and beyond. You can see Friday into Saturday. Friday, slowly climbing temperatures. Check out midnight. Still in the mid to if not upper 40s. But once the cold front rolls through, it really quickly tanks our temperatures and then it just holds the temps near 30 degrees for Saturday. So Saturday, technically, if you look at the data, we'll have a high temperature close to about 50. But all day, it's going to be feeling more like the 30s, if not the 20s. Not a lot of moisture with this system. Both Friday and Saturday, we could see some light showers. Friday in the form of rain, Saturday in the form of lake effect snow. But again, the bigger impacts are going to be the cold and the winds with this. By 3 o'clock tomorrow, we will feel the wind. Gusts already reaching the 30 mile per hour range. And then Friday evening to Saturday morning especially, we could see some wind gusts between 45 and even 50 miles per hour. Right now, it's looking like the fastest gusts will be close to Lake Michigan. Here's the eight-day forecast for you. You can see temperatures will stay in the 30s after we drop there on Saturday, but the wind will settle on Sunday. A couple of chances of snow, not many, but pretty easy to take first start for December.